access prohibited for your safety access on or around something something so we are on we are with FBI agent Norman Jaden and Jaden is my dog's name but it's sweet regardless which we just probably had the most intense scene with the fucking crazy ass doctor surgeon person who tried to mess up Madison but uh... looks like Jeff prevailed and uh... he got what he what he went for and he, he survived and whoa where are you going you're walking towards scary things what the hell is that over there You're just wandering around. No big deal. There's not just a big crazy black guy in the crane or anything. I think you're a little slow, Jeff. That's racist. Norman Jaden, FBI. Can we talk for a minute? Yeah. I'm looking for the owner of a blue Chevrolet Malibu 83. I don't give a damn how the car got here, or whether you stole it or not. I just want to know who bought it from me. Sorry, man. Don't ring a bell. I got a real bad memory for me. Perhaps I can help you to remember. If we find out that you sold the car to the man we're looking for, you're looking at some pretty solid time inside, Jackie boy. <laughs> you trying to scare me with your big talk? I never saw your damn car. Now take a walk. I'd be scared of that man. I would literally, if I was Norman Jane, I probably would have a big number two in my in panties right now. Yeah, I will. If I'm Norman Jaden, I wear panties. The hell is that? Blood. Oh, it's a semen trail. Now, why is there blood here? The blood tracks lead to the acid bath. Go the opposite way, homie. Whoa! Look at all that. I wonder what happens if you find all the evidence in this room. Probably Mad Jacks. I wonder if you get a beautiful little trophy to go on your wall of fame and fortune. I am Norman Jaden, and I'm a Size crazy 10. FBI agent. Most likely a visitor. Maybe it's your own footstep, Norman. Size 13. Must be Matt Jackson. That is a big ass shoe. Uh, not really, actually. I wear 11s. Hmm. Yeah, not that big. Not the car I'm looking for. That's what she said, though. <laughs> oh snap. Traces of orchid pollen in the air inside the garage. He's the origami killer. Same brand of tire as the car I'm looking for. Has the killer's car been here? What is this? Is that a... Uh-oh. 
It must be his fingerprints again. Feel a beautiful sneeze coming on. Few traces of blue paint, same tire tracks, no doubt about it. Killer's car was here. He was right there. Jackson. What else is there? There's a lot of evidence and clues. Or in this room. Oh. Just his fingerprints everywhere. Big ass fingerprints. Watch out near that bed, you might find some disgusting evidence. Some maxi pads or something. His dirty tampons. That's his happy time poster. Jesus. There's a lot of evidence. Is there four new ones right there? Not the right car either. Damn! You got me, officer. I'll come clean. Now that car, she buff up real good. I painted her dangerous blue. In honor of the dangerous motherfucker that was driving her. Hands on your head, pig. I ain't got time to be playing around with you. Let's just get you out of sight and finish you off. Oh, just fucking him up. Oh, look at that. Just Matrix shit dodging. Oh my god, that's so epic. He's gonna punch him right in the nuts. Get the gun, get the gun! Got him. Enough fucking around. Now you're gonna tell me about the man with the blue car. Go fuck yourself in the ass. <laughs> I've no time to lose, Jack. I wanna know who that car belongs to. What you want don't mean shit to me. I ain't no snitch. You better just lock me up now, boy. Uh, broke my fucking nose, pig! Next, I'm gonna blow a hole in your face. Spill all of it. You won't scare me, Mr. CSI. You ain't got it in you. Do you like fireworks, Jack? Cause I bet them gas tanks are gonna blow up real nice. Shit, man, don't mess with the gasoline. Well, just say <laughs> it was an accident. Or rather, I'll say it was an accident cause you won't really be able to talk, will ya, Jack? You crazy motherfucker, you out of your mind, man! No, I don't know nothing about the guy. He wanted me to get rid of his dirty car, get him a new one with false plates. He paid cash, and I ain't the questioning kind. He said I was supposed to drop the word to a guy named Paco down at the Blue Lagoon when the car was done. Now that's all I know. We'll continue this discussion down at the station. You're under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything... Shit, not now. Anything you say can and will be 
Hey, <laughs> you look like you got a problem, man. Oh no. What? They letting you dope heads in the FBI now? God bless America. <clears throat> now I'm gonna give you a little help with your drug problem, Mr. Five O. Permanently. Dude. Get the fuck out. Get the fuck out of that car right now. Holy shit. Dude. You just fucking died. <gasps> Get out! Oh my god. <gasps> Holy shit! He's not even in there. Oh my god. He's about to fucking just suplex you. Oh no. Dude, he's a fucking machine. <laughs> Holy shit, you are done. You can't fucking stop this guy. Oh, here we go. Oh my god. He just doesn't give a fuck. Yeah, you're not you're not messing up any of the combinations. He doesn't care. He just still shits on you. Oh my god. He's just gonna stick you under there. Wow. You got so lucky. Oh, yummy. We have never seen that part. Like that entire part we never saw. <laughs> that was a long I, ass I knew you were scene. Up the, the drug thing though. Was, I don't even know what I did wrong in that. I was holding on everything. Dude, because like it gets cra it's like it's like R1. Hold X. Dude, it's L literally it's, six or seven it's, buttons. It's, you get like every button on there. And I got it Bernie somehow. Just got it. He's like, uh, and he's like okay, phew. Goodbye, Mad Jack.
That was insane. Now Scott Shelby's about to get his DW. So you with think the, the origami the, character is okay. Fred? You're sweating? That makes sense. Dude, it's intense. I have stuff. never seen I had never seen that and scene. You suspect Gordy Kramer, that right? was fucking scary. Or him or one of his men. Gordy has the time and the means, not to mention the fucked up attitude to go along with it. He's only a suspect, but he's a pretty guilty looking one. Who's, he did that whole scene case? correctly, and then he can't even yeah, sit down. Yeah, for a couple years. <laughs> Dude, you were getting uh, everything well, correct, maybe. and you were still getting fucked up by that guy. Magazines about origami. Do you think wrong. the killer could yeah. to one of those? Dude, I thought you were done. I thought you he died in the car. I was like, oh my god! Dude, I thought he was gonna die. I thought you were gonna... Well, a part of me happened. wants you to be well, killed by, <laughs> like, one of your guys to die. Great. Because I want to see how that shit plays soaking out. Wet. I need to warm up a little. Wet. Is it okay if I take a shower? She's dripping. I'll be my guest. She's trying to, she's Go trying, she's going to wash off the dripping. Well, I'll cook up the eggs while you're under Of her the being so soaked. You got to cook her eggs, bro. Trust me. No, I honestly have, like, 50 minutes. I was just going to be home early. It's chill, bro. It's chill, bro. Hey, Jeff, do you know how to make eggs? You like filth? Hey, you like filth? You either make the eggs, you get your DW. You don't make the eggs, you don't get your DW. All right? Now, this is, this is a DW situation. What are you going to do, Jeff? Well, I know what you just did. You just got shat on. You got sharded on. Get sharded on. Right, Lucas? Yep, Lucas is asleep, everybody. You like filth? I know I do. Keep cooking those eggs, big boy. They look yummy, though, don't they? Oh, eggs, 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 eggs. Okay. You don't need to give me a weird look just because I'm singing the Eggs National Anthem. Eggsies. It's so Banksy. That's a Banksy. Look at you just cooking eggs for days. I'm the only one that fucks up eggs, apparently. Okay, yeah, this looks yellow. <laughs> I gave her raw eggs and she just like, uh. Yeah, normally I like my eggs not raw. <laughs> He's like, yeah, my bad. Huh? <laughs> it's chill. It's chill. <laughs> it's chill. He's like, no, it's chill. <laughs> <laughs> raw eggs are yummy. They're better for you. They go straight to your heart. Make you more prone to disease. I took the liberty of borrowing your bathrobe. That's not it good. better on you. Just Scott Shelby just getting his, his heart on. Hey, that almost looks good enough to eat? What's what a that? bitch. The notebook I took from Manfred's place. According to this, about 30 clients bought spare parts for Royal Machines in the last 10 years. The killer may be one of them. Oh, you know, checking out the alibi of 30 clients one by one, that's a lot of legwork. Except just a runny nose for days. Sounds like I'm list. just doing lines off the of, list of subscribers hookers' to butts. You still got as that, in Charlie right? Sheen, yeah. pound winning. Yeah. Lord, wait. She's just jump. She's just leading the way. Scott Shelby's just following. He, he doesn't know what to do. If the killer really used a royal typewriter, and if he subscribed to an origami magazine, his name should be on both lists. Well, Lauren. Uh, I mean, that's just an assumption, but... Yeah, I suppose. His name is here somewhere. Help me. We're gonna find him. They're gonna stop midway and just bone. Right? Am I right or am I right? Yeah, I'm right. Oh, she's flashing a little skin.
I know, right? Wanted eggs, didn't even eat the eggs. How dare she? Just how fucking dare she? And now she's just trying to take over his office, find a name. What? No, they're not. It's a cutscene. The only guy whose name is on it's a cutscene, bro. Died when he was ten. What are you gonna do now? Dig up his coffin, make sure he's dead? I know it doesn't make any sense. Unless the killer was only using his name. Uh, but why use the name of a kid who died thirty years ago? Well, that's what we came to find out. The name is John Shepard. It should be on a grave around here somewhere. You never give up, do you? Why would she? Why would she give up? Her son died. She's trying to help. <laughs> this girl knows her mind all right. No point in trying to reason with her. Better find this grave. Oh, that was scary. Children plot. Nick, you can't just fall asleep. No, you can't actually. Because I said so. Excuse me. Maybe. I'm looking for the grave of a young boy who died about 30 years ago. Young boy, so he's in the children Shepherd. plots. You wouldn't know where it is by any chance. The Which children's you're not graves in. are in the next plot. Thanks. Scott Shelby, just a man. Just a cute man that I would make sweet, sweet love to. Tender love. Tender love and care. Catherine Scott. Excuse me. I'm looking for the grave of a boy named John Shepard. Straight ahead, a little further out. Thanks. He knows. He knows about the graves. Whoa. Camera angle changing and shit. Oh. Hey, Lauren. I found it. Oh, shit. Yep. Of course. Origami figures. Oh, I could That's one hell of a coincidence. <laughs> These flowers are fresh. Looks like someone's still tending the grave. Oh, youngin. That one I knew well. You knew John Shepard? I've worked this graveyard nearly all my life. I remember what happened. It was in 77. October, I think. 